Got a dripping faucet? We'll show you how to fix three types of single handle faucets, ball, cartridge, and ceramic disc. First, determine the source of the leak. A leaky spout means damaged parts inside the body. A leak at the base means damaged seals around the body. Turn off the shutoff valves. If they're stuck, turn off the main water valve. Turn on the faucet to release any residual water. Close the drain and place a towel in the sink to help protect it. Also, remove the aerator. If it's stuck, soak a towel in white vinegar and wrap it around the aerator for about an hour. After an hour, gently remove the aerator with a towel and pliers. As you're taking apart the faucet, lay the parts in order and snap a picture to help with reassembly. Put the parts in a plastic bag to take to the store. You can replace one specific part, but it's usually best to get a kit and replace all the parts. Also, buy a new aerator if yours is damaged. Keep in mind these directions are typical, but check the manufacturer's instructions for your faucet. On ball valve faucets, loosen the set screw and take off the handle. Then take off the cap. To repair a leaky spout, remove the cam, washer, and ball. Note how the holes in the ball line up with the faucet body. Use a small screwdriver to remove the seats and springs. To repair leaks at the base, slide off the spout, then replace the O-rings. Add a little plumber's grease and replace the spout. Put new seats on new springs and put them back in place. Replace the ball, making sure the holes are lined up, then replace the washer and cam and reassemble the rest of the faucet. For cartridge faucets, remove the cap and take out the screw and clip. Then take off the handle and trim ring. Unscrew the retainer and pull out the cartridge. Insert a new cartridge, then reassemble the faucet. To repair a ceramic disc faucet, remove the handle and trim ring. Unscrew the retainer nut and pull out the cylinder. Instead of repairing the discs on the bottom, it's best to install a new cylinder. Put the faucet back together and turn it on. For all faucets, turn on the supply valve slowly and without the aerator, let the water run for a few minutes to flush out any debris. Clean a dirty aerator by soaking it in white vinegar. Rinse it and screw it back in. Now your faucet should be working like new. Want more great ideas and how-tos? Go to lowes.com slash how-to or click to subscribe. Rather have a new faucet? Check out our installation video.